Hey guys, Corey here from Sky's the Limit Car Care, and today we're going to talk about something we're super excited about, the Microfiber Madness Deli Mitt. So the Microfiber Madness Deli Mitt, uh, the name Deli Mitt, the Deli is from Delicate, and then of course a mitt because you you have a wash mitt. So as with all Microfiber Madness products, they're all individually packaged to show how much, uh, you know, they inspect them and then pack them in each one of these uh, after they're finished being fabricated. Um, these are 100% made in Germany. Um, this is not to be confused with the Incredimit, which obviously everybody's heard of the Incredimit. That's kind of revolutionized the washing process um, over the last uh, six, seven years now since Microfiber Madness introduced that and, uh, and brought that to the market. Anyway, the Incredimit is super popular. Everybody uses it, everybody loves it, but there was a problem with really super soft paint that I think a lot of people are aware of. With really super soft paint, it's very difficult to find something that can't swirl it or, or is, is completely safe on those real soft paints. Um, traditionally, people would use like a, a merino mitt. Um, for sure, uh, that's the safest option, but there does have some drawbacks. Number one, um, wool is obviously from an animal. Um, that's not always the nicest thing to do to the animal so that you can, you know, so you can take something from him just so you can wash your car. Um, so synthetic options, uh, you could argue, are a lot uh, better for, for things like that. Additionally, the merino wool uh, will often rot or uh, stay soaked. Um, the inside of a merino wool mitt will trap water. A lot of people will turn that inside out and try to you know, get it dry, but then it becomes stiff. Um, it doesn't rinse out as easily as microfiber does. Uh, it doesn't grab the dirt quite as easily. But again, traditionally, merino has been the, the best or only option for really soft paint. Um, the really cool thing about the deli mitt for microfiber madness is now you have something that will pull the dirt off the car even better than a merino wool mitt, but also is super soft. So um, the fibers on this are, are a different blend than what you have on the Incredit mitt. The size of this mitt is actually the exact same size as the Incredimit. They had, uh, they felt like they had the perfect size that, that they'd uh, created for the Incredimit, so they held that. Um, they also held the handle inside that they have on the Incredimit. They have that also here on the on the deli mitt, and that goes all the way down to the bottom. So not too many people use it, but it's such a cool, innovative little thing that they thought of. Also, this does have the same foam. Uh, layer inside the pad or inside the mitt so that that collects a lot of uh, water and soap and that's a special foam so that when you dunk it in your wash bucket and then you take it over your car it gives you a little bit of time for all that to release out it doesn't all just come come right back out like some wash mitts so it has a nice a nice foam inner layer oh and besides that it's like one of my favorite colors so <laughs> it's awesome mitt so just like with the Incredimit Microfire Madness has carried over there exactly the same cuff, super high quality, doesn't rot and tear. You'll find on a lot of wash mitts that are, there's, you know, there's a ton of wash mitts out there. Almost all of them are really poorly and cheaply made. Uh, the thing that I love about Microfire Madness is they use the highest quality products. And I mean, I've got my Incredimit, the first Incredimit I ever, that I ever bought, that I ever started using on my own cars. I'm still using it to this day, years later. And none of the elastic has gotten brittle or started popping out and scratching cars. Um, on the mitts that I used to use before I discovered Microfiber Madness, uh, that, that's what would happen within, even within a year uh, or less. The, um, the, the elastic that's inside their cuffs just starts coming out because it's cheap and uh, just really poorly made, low quality. They're just trying to sell you cheap stuff. And that's the antithesis, the polar opposite of what Microfiber Madness is about. So from the, all the way up to the cuff, all the way down to the fibers, you're getting super high quality products and they're made in, this product's made 100% in Germany, uh, made by uh, labor that earns a high living wage, something you can be proud of. This isn't made in some, you know, factory somewhere in the world where they're, you know, paying somebody a, a dime and, and, you know, slapping them around if they don't get their job done, which still happens in the world. That something that Microfire Madness is very passionate about um, not supporting, and so that's why they're, uh, they uh, are so intent on making this 100% in Germany. Um, beyond that, uh, I should back up a little bit and talk about uh, soft paint, uh, which is what this product was made for. On a lot of paints, once you 
do the basics and you wash it right, you know, get the dirt out of your mitt regularly and go through the steps that we've outlined in other videos, then it's pretty easy to keep swirls off your car. You know, you might pick one up every now and then, but it's very rare. Uh, but for people that have <laughs> happened across a model or a year, uh, year make model of paint that is soft, and when I say soft, I mean it's easy to swirl, um, easy to scratch, you know, you just touch it with just even most wash mitts and um, the majority of towels out there and it just scratches it without having done anything wrong. Anybody that's run across those situations, they can appreciate having a mitt that's much more or much less likely to swirl if, if used correctly. And so that's what this is all about. Um, there's a lot of paints out there, again, you know, like we've said, um, that are harder, and in, that, in those cases, we would still recommend the Incredimit. Um, it's a fantastic product. Uh, it's probably going to continue to be our, our biggest seller when it comes to wash mitts, but for those that have softer paints, this is great. So there's, it, it just depends on the year, the make and the model of the vehicle, but uh, when you have that problem, this is definitely the right tool for you. I think that goes over everything I wanted to talk about today with regards to the mitt. We're actually going to do a demo with it soon. If you haven't already subscribed to our YouTube, be sure to do so. Um, if you have any comments or questions, make sure to leave those below and we will answer them right away. Uh, we really appreciate you guys. We really appreciate you watching the video. And um, if you want to pick up a deli mitt, there's a link right here. Go ahead and grab that. And uh, we look forward to talking to you next time. Have a great day, guys. Take care.